Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Brainiac Gospel. On May 25, 2020, ignited a nationwide movement against police brutality in the United States. And this is not the first time the United States is facing such race riots. Racism by definition means to prejudice, discrimination or antagonism directed against someone of a different race based on the belief that one's own race is superior. So let us look into the history of racism in the America and the violent riots the America has faced. Between 1525 and 1866, 12.5 million people were kidnapped from Africa and sent to the America through the transatlantic slave trade. 3.9 million of the people who survived the harrowing two-month journey were enslaved in the United States. John Kaser, originally servant of an African descent, lost a case conveyed to determine whether his contract had lapsed in 1654 or 1655. He became the first individual declared a slave for the life in the United States. Matlida McRae was the last known survivor of the transatlantic slave trade. Now let us see the systemic inequality. Racial, economic and educational disparities are deeply entrenched in the US institutions. Instances of inequality range from the obvious to less overtly discriminatory policies and belief systems. Historical examples of the former include poll taxes that effectively disenfranchised African American voters, the marginalization of African American soldiers who fought in World War I and World War II but were treated like second class citizens at home, black innovators who were banned from filing patents for their inventions, and the African Americans had to suffer a lot. They had to suffer in the late 90s and also they are suffering right now. All these sufferings led to a protest. Now let us look at the protests. Prior to civil war, enslaved individuals rarely revolted outright. Nat Turner, whose 1831 insecration ended in his execution, was one of the rare exceptions. A fear in Christian, he drew inspiration from the Bible, his personal copy now housed in the collections of the African American History Museum, represented the possibilities of something else for himself and for those around him. On the other hand, other enslaved African Americans practiced less risky forms of resistance, including working slowly, breaking tools and setting objects on fire. One of the great revolt which is marked in history is the April 1712 revolt found enslaved New Yorkers setting fires to white-owned buildings and firing on slaveholders. If you are interested in knowing the list of race riots in America, click on the given link in the description box. And most re recent riots in America include New York City FTP protests, January 31st, anti-transit people and police and MTA protests resulting in hundreds of arrests over the three separate days of demonstration. Vandalism and violence on train stations were reported. In 2020, George Floyd protests started on May 27 in Minneapolis's Miniesta after killing of George Floyd. He was killed in Minneapolis by Officer Derek Chauvin, who was later fired and charged with murder. Protests spread to other American cities and the other countries with the killing of George Floyd, garnering international condemnation. The protest was largely peaceful although looting and arson did take place. That's all for today and also don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Comment down if you want a detailed video on John Kaser, the first slave. If there are more than 20 comments for yes, I would consider it. Thank you.